acting kind of weird even for you. Are you sober? <laughs> no, Aquarius. Okay, now try to pick one of us up. <laughs> what are you doing, man? You look the latest. <laughs> All right, put me down. Okay, you're dumb and lazy. <laughs> oh, there's my lady. Excuse me. You're blocking the aisle. <laughs> hey. Hi, Leo. Come here often? <laughs> hey, Leo, uh, it's my dad, WB. Whoa. Now I've seen everything. The surprise is black, huh? No. This flies open, man. <laughs> what do you think, man? Can you fix it? I don't know, man. You kind of caught me at a bad time. Right in the middle of Hawaii Five O. Leo, there's no TV in here. That doesn't change the fact that it's on. What's the funny part? Oh, see, I was hoping that was the funny part because I put the ha ha in there. <laughs> it made me laugh. <laughs> Yeah, and, and I peed in your pool. Leo, you weren't even at the party. I know, that's why I peed in his pool. Man, am I glad I found you guys. All these houses look alike. Except for that red one on the corner where the clown lives. That's a McDonald's. Well, whatever his name is, he's funny. <laughs> Hey, what's with the baby, man? I don't know. I can't get it to quit crying. Here, let me try. Yeah. Here. <laughs> How'd you do that? Babies love me, man. Because <laughs> I'm fuzzy. Are you sure this is your house? Of course it's my house. I believe you. The guy screaming usually owns the house. Can I help you? Leo, it's me, Randy. I got hired last week. We drove in together? Oh, yeah, Frankie. Randy. No, it's Leo. Getting better. <laughs> Leo, check it out, it's my baby! Oh. oh, this is Brooke. Oh, isn't she adorable? Yeah. I can see why you knocked her up. <laughs> hey, all right, hand her over. Yeah, you're so attached, just... Oh! <laughs> Look, don't worry. All she does is sleep. It's like taking care of a bowling ball. I don't like bowling, man. You throw the ball down there and it keeps coming back. It's spooky, man. Hey, hi, man. Hey, man. Listen, I want some tunes, so I need to find a record store. Leo, you're in a record store. Whoa, that was fast, man. <laughs> So what are you doing here? I'm the boss, man. Which is ironic, because I'm also the least motivated employee. <laughs> so if you have a whole record store, how come you've been kind of mopey lately, man? I'm not mopey, I'm fine. Well, where's that loud girl you're always hanging with? <laughs> Jackie, she's in Chicago. Wait. If Jackie's in Chicago, I have a question. What? Who's Jackie? Jackie's the loud girl. Loud girl's in Chicago. Hey, that's why you're sad, man. You love loud girl. Maybe I do. You know what? The only reason I'm admitting that is because you have no short-term memory. You're going to forget this conversation when it's over. Hey, that's not true, man. Hey, guess what I found out? What, Leo? 
Lab girls in Chicago. So, I decided that tomorrow after I say goodbye to Foreman, I'm gonna go to Chicago. Hey, loud girls in Chicago. <laughs> you should look her up. Good idea. Anyway, what I was thinking is while I'm gone, you could run the record store. It'd be fun, man, like the old days of the photo hut. <laughs> you know the film place you used to own? Wait, was it a little blue house in the middle of a parking lot with a drive-up window? Exactly. I don't remember that at all, man. Who cares? That's true, man. <laughs> Listen, you guys know I don't allow alcohol in my house. So you're just gonna have to drink sake instead. That for dangerous. <laughs> yeah, I think Debbie's really gonna like this. <laughs> hey, Debbie, no, Donna. Right. Okay, no problem. I can fix it. Fix what? Relax. Debbie will never notice it. It's Donna. See, now you move, man. It's okay, I can make that into a flower. You know what you should get? Boobs. Big boobs on your butt. That's classy. Hey, I can turn the bees into boobs. Wait, what bees? Like in Debbie, your girlfriend? It's Donna. Oh, right. Oh, I can fix that. In front of you. I picked a bad place to take a nap. You can just cover up by yourself. Okay, um, I'll be right back with your blankie. Thank you. <laughs> Leo, I'm so sorry I hurt you. Oh, it's all right, man. I'll be fine. At least I still got it all up here. Well, that's just good genes, man. My father had a good hairline, too. Well, nice job, Fez. Fender's dented, the taillight's shot, so you owe me 80 bucks. <laughs> okay, good luck with that. <laughs> I'm broke. Well, like my mom used to tell me, shut up and give me some money. Hey, you guys. I was just next door, and you know that weird kid from school who's always saying he can fly? <laughs> yeah, he can't. <laughs> so, Leah, how's the hospital? Oh, it's great, man. Cable TV, free parking. Don't have to get out of bed to take a pee. It's just like a hotel. And Nurse Kitty and I have had some good times. Hey, Red. Could you give these to your wife, please? And tell her I love her. I'll give her the message. Thank you. Oh, boy. You got a date for the stoner's ball. <laughs> Roses are red, violets are blue, milk, eggs, coffee. Yep, it's me. Hey, is my lady around? Leo, buddy, we gotta talk. You're getting me in a lot of trouble around here. Now, I'm begging you. Who is it, Red? Listen, Hophead. I love that woman with a fiery passion that consumes my soul. That's right. So you can either walk out of here on your own 
or you can hop out of here with my boot in your ass. Okay, I choose the one with nothing in my ass. Good choice. There's my girl. Hi, Leo. <laughs> Leo, you didn't have to get me chocolates. Chocolates? That's my lunch. <laughs> Leo, look. I'm really flattered that you like me, but I can't be your girlfriend. Is it because I'm black? <laughs> You're not black. So it's not that then. I know what it is. You like that Randy guy. What? No, I don't. Yes, you do. So I think maybe it's best if we stop seeing each other. Wait a minute. You're breaking up with me? I'm sorry, but I just can't date a racist. So, Leo, you're single again. You gonna be okay? Yeah, <laughs> I've already got my eye on somebody better. Excuse me? Hey, come here often? Leo, what's your idea of a romantic date? November 13th. But this year it's ruined, man. I gotta go to the dentist. I just had the best meal, man. Somebody left two whole steak dinners in there. Now, if you excuse me, I'm off to the monster truck show. Are you done? <laughs> What's so funny? Guess I'm just a happy guy. Hey, it's a naked lady from the newspaper. <laughs> okay. Hey, not to worry. I hit him in a Barry White album. Great. Where's that? You'll have to ask the guy who bought it, duh. Who you sold that record to. Think. Who have you seen today? Well, I remember a guy with scraggly hair and a beard. And he was brushing his teeth. That was you in a mirror. And then there's this other guy with big lips and another guy with long hair and another guy with a thumbtack in his head. That would be the Aerosmith poster. <laughs> hey, that's so weird, man. I was just thinking of moving to Point Place. And you too, Leo. You always make my day when you wave and smile hello even if you are urinating on my mailbox. <laughs> <laughs>